Christina. If I hadn't applied, then none of this would have happened. He for beat you up. He set this in motion. You didn't. I'm the one who lied about Ethan hitting me, and all he was trying to do was help. Dad was ready to kill him. I almost cost Ethan his life, and now he might die again because of me. If I would have just told the truth in the first place, none of this would have happened. Mr. Bauer was right. No, Mr. Bauer's messed up, Christina. I saw the way he came at you. He was going to hit you just the way that Kiefer did. Dad says that that's where Kiefer might have gotten it from. And that's awful for Kiefer. But that doesn't give him the reason to hit you. None of this is your fault. Mr. Bauer is going to shoot me, and you are going to take the bullet. Michael. Yeah, that's, that's over now, Christina. You don't need to think about that anymore. Oh, great. Okay, great, thank you. All right, so they're prepping Ethan. Do you want me to scrub in? Yeah, Epiphany 2. I'll put Sydney on your team. 4 3 I'm right behind you. Okay, well, I'll page go, you, Epiphany, go, go. but all of the floors are locked down by the cops. I mean, you might have to just grab whatever nurses I want the get. strongest people we have assisting on these surgeries. Right. If the police give you trouble, tell them the commissioner's life is at stake. Every second they waste is a second we can be in there trying to save them. But you are going to save him, right? Thank you, Dr. Dr. Garrett. I'm going to do my best. Max's pressure is still too low. Even with fluids and transfusions, he can still code on the table. Max is strong and is healthy. He's incredibly strong, but he needs to be. For me and for Maxie. Even when our parents were off God knows where, he was the one who stepped in and made our lives normal. about a release he wanted me to sign to get access to my medical records. And when I said no, he started yelling and making threats, and he was about to hit me when Michael walked in. Uh, and I completely lost him. I went after Mr. Bauer. I wasn't about to let anybody hurt Christine ever again. And then he wanted to press charges against me, sent me back to Pentonville, but Mac and Lucky turned the other way. And he left. No one knew he had a gun on him. Then we returned to the nurse's station. He just completely lost it, said he was going to kill Christina, that it was justice for his son. No, Christina, what happened in there is not your fault. Okay. Clearly, um, Lauren, I've been out of control for a while, all right? It's not your fault that he started shooting up the hospital. Mac's gonna be okay. I would never admit this to my brother, but he's a very good surgeon. He's one of the best I've seen Uncle Mac. Couldn't be in better hands. I just keep thinking about everything that could go wrong. Embolism, infection. If something goes wrong, Matt will fix it. What if he can't? Then I'll be there to back him up. You need to stay strong. You need to focus on what you know. Mac was shot twice in the chest. He's got a collapsed lung. He's got internal bleeding. Go over it in your head, step by step, every cut, every suture, like you were in the room with us. You know, there's no one that I trust more than you and Matt. I just can't imagine a world without my Uncle Mac in it. Dr. Hill, you need to report for the operating room. Any luck with the OR team? Uh, yeah, Cindy is scrubbing in. Epiphany's on her way up. I'll meet you there. Is Cindy going to be all right? Yeah, he made it to the OR without bleeding out, thanks to you. I'm just happy I could help him. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Easy there. Take a deep breath. You all right? You okay? Yeah, sorry. Okay. Sorry, I just got a little bit of lightheaded. Yeah, yeah, well, poking your finger around the center's already. I'll do that to you. This is getting to be a bit of a habit, <laughs> winding up in your arms. I guess I'd be flattered if, uh, if I didn't know the surgeons had a hero complex. I was looking for someone to save. Right? He's next on my list. Good luck in there. Olivia, I wanted to thank you, too, for jumping in when I froze. I, I wanted to help Ethan, but... I just I couldn't move. Ethan's not the first person you've seen get shot, is he? Max is gonna be fine. He has to be. He I can't. He, he has to be all right. Look, if he were going to leave us, he would have done it a long time ago. And it would have been for some tropical island, not a sterile OR without an umbrella drink in sight. 
He has dealt with so much, with the two of us. Vacation's a really good idea. We could pitch in and send him to one of those singles resorts. <laughs> or trick Alexis to go with him. You know, I really, I have not given up on the idea of those two together. I've been so selfish. I've only argued with Mac or taken him for granted. Mac knows how much we love him. No, lately I've only been around when I needed something. I'm so caught up with myself that I feel like I've been missing what's right in front of me. Yeah, between Emma and work, I just hardly see him anymore. Well, I'm praying that Matt is as brilliant as he says he is. And we will have the chance to show Mac how much we care about him. How is he? He's a mess. Bullets did a lot more damage than I thought. All right, tell me what you need. Well, he's losing blood a lot faster than we can hang it. So, let me figure out where he's losing it from. Okay. 